So, so if there wasn't an agreement that Nasipi Moya will become the next mayor with the support of the ANC, um, would you be able to tell us why your chairperson, Michael Bowman, told News24, we are concerned? Why would Action SA be concerned if the ANC is going to field its own candidate? Well, I think, uh, you know, my history with the ANC that dates back uh, long before mm. you were even born. Mm -hmm. These are family, these are friends, these are people I grew up uh, with. I only got really close with them when they started uh, this corruption that yep. really destroyed millions of, of, of lives. With Tony, I'm changing my mind. Uh, we are going to remove, let's remove uh, this uh, the, the DA mayor. Is that hypocritical of the party, of Action SA? That you campaign for well, people to vote well, for Action SA okay. um, against a corrupt ANC, and here is Action SA today saying that actually let's get the ANC back into power. Okay, uh, uh, can I tell you something interesting? That what, was there an agreement before the motion of no confidence between Action SA and the ANC that um, once Mayor Celia Brink is ousted, that Action SA will field a candidate? No, it was, there was not. Uh, I've, I've always been clear, including actually in a press conference, yep. that we will not have uh, any uh, written agreement with the ANC. We will have principal agreement. I proposed uh, Dr. Nasipi to the ANC before uh, the, the, the serious negotiations, which have not really taken place. We are very, we're at the moment, uh, busy putting measures in place to start serious negotiations because we've got 14 days mm -hmm. and a few days have already gone. So, yes, I proposed, and I see uh, in, the in the media that they have their own proposals. What I'm saying as Action SA, we will, uh, all, all parties, ensure that we, do, uh, yeah. we, we, so, so we, we, we actually go for the best candidate. Yeah. What, what, what was, was you putting forward Nasipi Moya's name um, just a, this is the name that us as Action SA is putting forward, not necessarily that we want, as per an agreement, that um, Nasipi Moya no. be elected a, the mayor a, a, a. and we will then in turn support the ANC in that motion of no confidence. Absolutely. It was uh, saying to them, guys, in Tony in particular, mm -hmm. because because of the abuse Action SA suffered from DA, uh, insults and so forth. And uh, originally when ANC approaches the, the Aldrin, I'm sure you can remember, we all wanted at the time in all the, the municipalities, uh, the three municipalities, only to occupy the legislature. But DA made a terrible mistake. Instead of uh, actually dealing with this uh, matter with, de with respect, they decided to insult us, insult ANC. I then said uh, to the ANC during one of the, the discussions, I said, you know what, guys, I've really had enough of uh, this DA arrogance. Mm -hmm. My body cannot take uh, this abuse any longer. With Tony, I'm changing my mind. Uh, we are going to remove, let's remove uh, this uh, the, the DA mayor, but Action SA wants um, executive position so that we can co-govern with you guys. I'm happy in, in Johannesburg to really play the role of, uh, of, of, of uh, the legislature as we originally thought. But uh, the arrogance uh, and the disrespect of this uh, DA, I think one needs to really teach them a lesson. Yeah. This is not 19, 1948. This is 2020, 2024 with the constitutional democracy. We are not going to allow people to uh, abuse us like this. Take us uh, to be corrupt, uh, to uh, all of us to be incompetent. We've got to really show them the lesson to really respect us. Um, so, so if there wasn't an agreement that Nasipi Moya will become the next mayor with the support of the ANC, um, would you be able to tell us why your chairperson, Michael Bowman, told News24, we are concerned, um, but I think it is very important that you do not try to negotiate gov a government through the media. In other words, people say all things, but we need to sit down and have a real conversation. Why would he be concerned? Why would Action SA be concerned if the ANC is going to field its own candidate? Well, I think, uh, look, fortunate enough, uh, this uh, ANC agreements, I'm on record as well, that uh, this particular uh, agreements with the ANC, I'm going to lead them myself, because I'm sure you know my history with the ANC that dates back uh, long before mm. you were even born, mm -hmm. <laughs> Aldrin. So I know the ANC to people. These are family, these are friends, these are people I grew up uh, with. I only got really close with them when they started uh, this corruption that yep. really 
destroyed millions of, of, of lives. So that is why as uh, the, I had uh, the privy of being the one negotiating with the ANC, with the ANC the, than Michael Bowman. Michael must have obviously said to them, guys, I've proposed uh, Nasi P. Moyo as, as, as our um, as, as, as our candidate, and at the time, ANC had no problem. But it says, guys, we will obviously to formalize this when we start formal negotiations. Actually, before I left overseas about a month ago, ANC wanted us to immediately get involved in negotiations, but I declined. Why? Because I wanted to ensure that before I formalize my negotiations with the ANC, let me consult our structures, our Houghton PEC, our 20 REC and our caucus. I said, please uh, give us two weeks or so, and I'm leaving in, in two mm. days' time. I'm leaving for overseas, but the process will run. On my return, we, um, once I get the report and the report, uh, our teams are happy, we will then start the negotiations. I come back. A DA went out, all out using every available propaganda to discredit and insult ANC. If you look at um, the, uh, the, the propaganda unleashed against ANC people, I wonder how yeah. ANC actually feel. I don't understand DA's negotiations. They want, they want the support of outing ANC, but they are insulting them like, yeah. I mean, they, like they're nothing, they're crooks, so, they're so, corrupt. So, so in your negotiations, with the ANC, you, you went into a negotiation that we're going to support you in your motion of no confidence, but we don't have an agreement yet as around who would be filling that vacancy. No, that, that vac let that me vacancy. tell you to something uh, uh, in which also I'm on record on this. Yeah. When I started and agreed uh, to, uh, to meet with the ANC, we had already made our mind that we only need uh, the support of our structures. Personally, I, him and Mashaba, I'd already taken a decision. My relationship with the, with the DA is what under yeah. the bridge. My body can't take it any longer. However, this is not my party. This party belongs to, to our members. Let's consult them, get uh, to see how they feel. You know what, uh, 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 Aldrin, when we consulted our, our the people, actually two days before I left, the first group I saw was uh, uh, encountered with was our Houghton PEC. Mm -hmm. I can tell you that meeting was hot because I can tell you they, they were not even prepared uh, to go through the, 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 um, the review process. They said, uh, Herman, please, let's cut the mm. umbilical yeah, cord. But, but, but I want no. to understand that how, how does Action SA go into a meeting with the ANC to remove the mayor in the city of Tuane, but there's no agreement around what happens after there is a vacancy? No, okay, let me tell you how simple it is. Okay. Because remember what triggered us uh, from uh, taking decision was the, a, was the a DA leadership approaching ANC leadership to remove us from Tony. So we are going to be removed in any way. So that's why mm -hmm. I said to my team, we are not going to wait to be removed by, ANC, by the DA. We are not going to be pushed. So whatever happens, whether we, we, we come to an arrangement with the ANC or not, Action SA is out of, uh, out of trying with, with, the, with the DA. With the, with the and, DA. and also, now take the other dynamic now. In the event ANC and DA don't really come together, Without Action SA, none of the two groups can form a party because they don't have, uh, they don't have the numbers. So that's why to make sure that the stability in the city of Tswane, there can be government, we've decided, okay. uh, we've made available, uh, ourselves available to the ANC, and we are still available. But Does, if they come to arrangement with the DA, fine, Action SA is happy to be on, on the opposition benches. Uh, so does this mean that if the ANC decides to field its own candidate, Action SA will support that candidate? I think... They will uh, vote in, 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 in support. Of the I think, Aldrin, uh, you know, uh, negotiations of this nature, anyone who's going to conduct them in, uh, in public, that person is a fool, it's irresponsible. These are very sensitive matters actually yeah. involving the public. I don't think, uh, honestly, it would really be wise for me. I know I'm not clever, I know I'm not clever, but I would not really want to really engage. But one thing I can promise society is that once we've agreed or not agreed, we'll come back uh, to you as a society because we are running a public organization. Yeah. We'll come back to you whether we are successful or not. Sure, but you did tell us that you put forward Nasipi Moya's name. We so I'm asking, yeah. here, yes. So I'm asking, if the ANC puts forward its own candidate, 
Will Action SA support the ANC? Well, uh, it, it depends uh, who they put uh, forward. They've got to put someone uh, better than uh, Dr. Nasipi. We, we look at it. But what I'm trying to say is uh, that uh, we... We, we know we're not clever, and the, some people have accepted my race not to be clever. And I, you know, but we're not fools. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm not going to engage in, uh, in negotiations of such sensitive okay. nature in public. What we do, we've got 14 days, and we've got few now, the few days have already passed. ANC and us, we are aware that uh, time is against us. We, once we've uh, negotiated, we've come to a decision as to who must lead, we will come back to you. There's just no way that uh, we, we will not uh, come back to society because uh, the mayor has to yep. really be elected in an open council meeting. I have to also say, uh, Mr. Mashaba, I find it fascinating, if anything, how um, Action SA is now almost a defender of the ANC when Action SA was actually a political party campaigning on the basis of trying to oust the ANC because the ANC was corrupt. That was Action SA's commitment um, to its voters. But here it is, Action SA seems to be scrambling to work with the ANC. Tell me, where do you get that impression from that uh, Action SA is a defender of, Action is, uh, of uh, ANC? Action SA is doing what is in the best interest of our country. In the event ANC and DA don't find each other, without Action SA's intervention, um, joining forces with the ANC, the city of Sun will be without government. So do you expect X Action SA to act in that irresponsible yeah. manner? But, but, it is for that but Action SA would essentially be taking a decision that also leads to the ANC being back in power. Do you agree to that? Well, uh, uh, but I'm not going to put arrogant, yeah, but, but disrespectful agree, but you agree people to into that, government. That Action SA's actions will essentially mean the ANC gets back into power with the help of Action but, SA. But they've got a, uh, if you respect democracy, this, this is what's happening in the city of Tswane and elsewhere. Yeah. It's a result and the outcome of a democratic process. People who don't respect democracy, they don't respect uh, the outcome. If anyone can bring forward to say the 2021 elections were not free and fair, then it's mm -hmm. something else. Here, the people have, of Tswane have spoken to say no single political but party yes. will govern. And it is our responsibilities as political parties to make sure that there's no vote. And Action SA is going to use their votes to bring the ANC back into power. Yes, because uh, we've removed, and proudly so, we've removed the DA who uh, uh, never respected us. We thought uh, they will come to their senses, but they operate as if it's 1948 when black people did not have uh, the universal suffrage. In Is that hypocritical of the party, of Action SA? That you campaign for well, people to vote well, for Action SA okay. um, against a corrupt ANC, and here is Action SA today saying that, actually, let's get the ANC back into power. Okay, uh, uh, can I tell you something interesting that you might really be aware? I know you're a clever in the, the journalist. On the 28th of May, um, 2024, show me any party that's in the current coalition, what they said about ANC. You want me to pull you out to yeah. show you? Yeah. And you are part so, of them? Yes. You are no, part of them? We, and we're not the yes. God. But what I'm trying to say, as human beings, uh, um, uh, Aldrian, all the time, you have to operate on prevailing circumstances. You don't take decisions in a vacuum. When you are confronted uh, with a particular challenge, God has given us the brains to make sure that you react appropriately. Right now, we don't have the luxury or the, the arrogance to say we are going to govern on our own section. They say we don't have that luxury. Yeah. DA does not have that luxury. ANC does not have that luxury. The voters of Tswane have demanded of us to put our own personal views and opinions aside and govern them and govern them as coalition partners. Yeah. And that's exactly what Action SA is doing. Okay. Um, and, and then just on a quick another, another matter, the Minister of Justice and Constitutional Development, the matter that was taken to the public protector, um, we heard now Ethel Trollope saying that the public protector didn't investigate the, uh, the matter. Um, the next step then for Action SA with regards to this particular issue? Well, I, I think uh, I saw it uh, the, the yesterday and last night. Obviously, I think uh, I, uh, as much as I'm the leader of the party, they, 
uh, I'm not in, in, in parliament. I, I can't really be attuned of everything else. Okay. But I know our team in parliament have really been taking up on, on this matter. And they have uh, our mandate to pursue any matter that is not in the public interest. Okay.